Hi guys, Monday and Jira are two of the most popular project management tools today, but which one should you be using? To help you make an informed decision, I'll explain the main differences between Monday and Jira, and we'll consider five criteria to see how these two tools stack up. We'll leave the link in the description, and you can use it, and you can start with the free version, and if you like it more, you can upgrade, risk-free. And thanks for using the links in the description. So let's find out which is better for you. For the user friendliness, both Jira and Monday.com have their own strengths in this area, making it difficult to declare a clear winner. The subjectivity of user friendliness doesn't help either. However, we did notice some key differences and overlaps, particularly in their web clients. Jira is simpler compared to Monday.com. This translates to a cleaner and sleeker interface with just one board and supporting features. You'll have a lot of white space to fill up with tasks, or leave it blank if you prefer. On the other hand, Monday.com is a bit more involved. It offers several views to switch between, but you'll likely stick to the list view for inputting tasks. Each task can have various details attached to it, such as due dates, priorities and status, as well as customizable fields. Overall, the choice between Jira and Monday.com for user friendliness comes down to simplicity versus enhanced overview. However, both have a shallow learning curve and are easy to use with no need to search for specific buttons or get stuck on figuring something out. So in this round, we'll have to call it a tie. And for the integration, both Jira and Monday.com offer integrations with add-ons, but Monday.com has a more limited selection of add-ons, mainly consisting of cloud storage services and communication apps like Slack. However, users can create their own integrations using Zapier or IFTTT. On the other hand, Jira has its own add-ons and also allows third-party add-ons via the Atlassian Marketplace, similar to its sibling Trello. Atlassian prioritizes sleek software that users can expand on their own. However, it's important to note that not all Jira add-ons are of equal quality and some may require an extra fee. If you have both Jira and Monday.com accounts, integrating the two can be extremely beneficial. For example, you can have your development team work in Jira, while designers and marketers work in Monday.com. Tasks can be exported from one app to another during a new phase, creating a seamless solution. This is also the only way to get a proper scrum board in Monday.com, as it's lacking in this regard. And for the services and support, one of the standout features of Monday.com is that it provides support for all subscription tiers. This means that no matter what plan you're on, you'll have access to their support team. They also have easy-to-follow tutorials and documentation available, as well as an active forum community. Jira, on the other hand, only offers support for their top paid plans, so if you're on a lower tier plan, you won't have access to their support team. However, like Monday.com, they also offer easy-to-follow tutorials and documentation, as well as an active forum community. Both platforms offer on-screen guides to help users get familiar with the software. However, if you need to delve deeper, both platforms offer access to their support portal guides. This method allows users to figure out things on their own, but provides documentation when necessary. One thing we particularly like about Monday.com is their pop-ups. They're user-friendly and straightforward, and they can be easily dismissed. On the other hand, Jira offers a quick start menu for new users acting as a guided tour. Users can choose the subject they want to learn more about and then select from a few options such as watching a video, reading documentation or getting pop-ups relevant to the issue on their screen. Although it can be a bit clunky, we believe it has significant potential. And for the security and privacy? When it comes to security and privacy, we believe that Monday.com is the clear winner. While both services offer a decent level of data protection, Monday.com truly excels in both areas. The main difference between the two services is where they store customer data. Jira uses AWS, while Monday.com stores data in-house. Despite both using AES-256 encryption to protect data at rest, AWS has a history of data leaks, which has improved but not enough for our satisfaction. This means that we feel more confident with Monday.com's approach to data storage. Examining the privacy policies of both services reveals that the minor details matter. Both have their drawbacks, but Monday.com's policies are more favourable overall. 
They acknowledge using low-level device fingerprinting, which some users may find concerning, but Atlassian doesn't guarantee that they won't sell your data, which is a definite red flag. And for the pricing? Monday offers different pricing plans to suit your needs, starting with the individual plan, which is completely free and allows up to two users, three boards, unlimited docs, and 0.5 gigabyte file storage. If you need more features, you can upgrade to the basic plan for $8 per user per month, billed annually, with a minimum of three users, approximately $24 per month, which includes unlimited boards, five gig file storage, timeline and Gantt views, and all individual plan features. The standard plan is priced at $10 per user per month, billed annually, and includes all basic plan features plus 20 gigabyte file storage, automations, integrations, and guest access. For more advanced features, you can go for the Pro plan, which costs $16 per user per month, billed annually, and includes all standard plan features plus 100 gigabyte file storage, automations, integrations, unlimited guest access, private boards and docs, formula column, chart view, and time tracking. Finally, if you need even more advanced features and customization, you can go for the Enterprise plan, which comes with custom pricing. Keep in mind that the platform offers discounts for plans billed annually. Prices are higher if you pay monthly. Now, let's move on to Jira. Jira Software Cloud by Atlassian also offers different pricing plans for teams of various sizes. They have a free plan for up to 10 users. The standard plan is priced at $7.75 per month, approximately $77.50 per month, while the premium plan costs approximately $152.50 per month. The plans come with different features, including user limits, number of sites, automation, reporting and insights, apps and integrations, and security and compliance. And the enterprise plan requires annual billing. The enterprise plan includes all premium features and more advanced capabilities. If you need enterprise-grade security and centralized administration, you can also subscribe to Atlassian Access, which includes SAML, single sign-on, user provisioning, and deprovisioning. So choosing between Monday and Jira depends on your business and your needs. Both tools come with advantages and disadvantages, so there's no best solution. It'll depend on your current needs. So yeah. That's it for this video. You can check the links in the description and that helps a lot, thank you. And hopefully this video will help you out. If it did, please leave a comment and click the like button. That helps too. And goodbye for now.